Hey, what's up guys? I'm Mako. Welcome to video number two of the Genshin Impact Challenge I'm doing, where I only play the first four characters I pull. In the last video, I pulled Barbara as the first member of my team that I'm going to play. I'm not super psyched about it, but now that she's on the squad, I refuse to hear any Barbara slander. So with that being said, I went ahead and took a look at her talents. She is a healer, of course. I'm psyched that she does apply the wet status to enemies, but I'm not super stoked that she also applies it to my own team. So I'm a little bit worried for freeze comps, namely um, Diona, who I believe applies cryo to herself. Yeah, Barbara is definitely not optimally geared. I also don't really want to fight the Oceanid. That's probably my least favorite boss in Genshin. But that being said, I am psyched to have a decent healer on my team and she pretty much nails that role. I'll be so happy to get her C6 because it's a full revive to the team, which I didn't know she could do because I don't play her on my own account. And I genuinely think that could like help my Spiral Abyss attempts for a while. But now I'm debating if I need another healer like Bennett and I don't know necessarily what to do. I really want Barbara Constellation, so I'll probably just end up pulling on both banners, um, both the limited and the standard. I don't have any better options and I really need a DPS, so. Do I think Barbara can help 36 star the abyss? You know, who's to say? Really. Um, <laughs> but I do really need to build this team so I can start working on harder content and progress through the story. But I want another character before Dwan, so. So I think honestly, I'm just gonna do my polls now. And on it, yeah, fuck it. Fuck it, we ball. <sighs> so here we are, round two of wishing. Um, I think my best options right now would be Bennett, of course, um, because despite them both being healers, Bennett is always optimal. <laughs> Plus, then we get a vape comp. Um, I think after that, maybe Dendro, or maybe like Fischl for the Taze, or Sing Chu for a double hydro, uh, like battery. I don't, I don't know, maybe he would actually be a bad option, but... Damn, okay. Standard banner time. Doesn't that mean the next one is a character for sure? I didn't think that was possible. I didn't think- I didn't- God. I don't even 
know what to say. I have to build a team comp with Barbara and Dory. Oh my god. I might be so fucked. Um, I think my best bet right now is to make my way to Sumeru as fast as possible, and then come back and do the other storylines. Okay, I think we have access. She's a healer? Oh shit. I guess I don't have to build her as a healer, because I have Barbara. But it's good I have two already for the Spiral Abyss. I shit you not, I was heading towards this statue of the Seven, and I knew I had to like climb this big hill or whatever, and it took me forever because Dory is not a tall person. And as I waddled my little ass up to the top, I realized that oh my god, I climbed the entirely wrong hill. Also, they only give you a, like, a small chest for that? That's stupid. Okay, my thought right now is that if I make it to Sumeru, I can infuse the Traveler with Dendro, and then I basically have a Hyperbloom team. Not a very strong one, but... Okay, I've made it to Sumeru, which means it's time to infuse the Traveler with Dendro. This is officially the team, just until I am able to pull somebody to replace the Traveler, of course. But it's a makeshift type of bloom. Add Astra. I'm going to go to Amber's domain before ending the video, but I don't think it should be anything difficult as far as I remember, but it was a while ago, so we'll see. <laughs> The domain was indeed not fucking easy. It started off somewhat simple with Barb being able to clutch a long distance dub. Then it got a little harder when I realized Barbara has no aim attack and I didn't know how I'd defeat these electro nipples without a bow character. That's when I figured out the reason Dory is actually an SSS plus tier character because her electro genie auto targets the nippies. Huh. From there, shit hit the fan. These floating hilly trolls were the bane of my existence, 
But with a little height, I realize Barb can knock him out again. And I'm not calling the only male on my team useless, but I am calling the only male on my team useless. And then I got fucked fucked. Because they throw you into a round two for no reason. And without the explosive barrels, Dory couldn't hit the middle of the leaf. was. Bro, that hilly chariot is currently built better than my dory. Look at this. 84 damage. Anyways, that'll be the end of the fucking video. Uh, please make sure you guys like and subscribe, and have a good day. Fucking